Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Popular Stranger and I'm back again with another episode of my NCAA Football 13 Dynasty with the Tulsa Golden Hurricanes. And this is week number four, game number four of the season. Back home against the Fresno State Bulldogs. Coming off a huge win against number 11 Kansas State. Thrilling overtime victory. I hope you guys enjoyed that gameplay. Uh, from last episode. If you missed it, make sure you go check it out. There is a link in the description for the playlist of this entire series so you can go back and see every week up to date by clicking that playlist. And uh, as you see, we are still not ranked even after the big win, but that's okay. Speaking of ranked teams there, you're going to see West Virginia loses to Maryland, so the number five team in the country goes down. And Boise State loses to BYU and you see Boise State is number 24 and Auburn takes a loss at number 19 as well so those are two teams closer to the or towards the end of the top 25 that are getting knocked off and maybe I'll be able to replace them with a win here this week against Fresno State though it's not a very uh, you know daunting team a win isn't probably going to earn you much BCS points because they're not you know a ranked team or a power conference team um, but we start off on defense, you know, controlling the option there. And, you know, one thing I hate playing against, and I think this is one of them, is these hurry-up offense teams um, that are always doing the no-huddle. It just gets frustrating sometimes. And I love how my players celebrate there. Number 55 is very excited, like he had any any uh, reason why that kick missed. The guy just, I don't know why the computer even attempted that kick. Um, but, you know, sit back, relax, and cruise through the gameplay. It starts off slow, and then, uh, you know, things will get exciting eventually, I do promise. Uh, but another long video, and I'm always searching for topics to talk about for these Dynasty gameplays, just because all the videos average around 11-12 minutes. So I thought I'd just update you with some more things that are going on with me and, and, and this game. Uh, there's another missed field goal. I don't know why they kept attempting these really long field goals, but that's okay because it gives me great field position. I didn't get a chance to uh, take advantage of it the first time, but hopefully we can here. And again, I forgot to mention, you know, uh, gosh, Cody Green. I almost forgot his name there. Cody Green did get injured last game, if you guys might remember. So we're in with the freshman, Dan Evans, who played very well. Uh, at the end of the Kansas State game to lead a victory there and that's a very nice throw right there so the freshman is stepping in big nice touchdown toss and uh, I don't know guys could we have a, a quarterback controversy at our hands here Cody Green still out for another three weeks the freshman steps in finishes off a huge win against the number 11 team in the country and now he's here tossing bombs down the field for touchdown 7 nothing lead um, but yeah, I had mentioned earlier or in a previous video that I did start a road to glory with Avon von Arksdale. Um, as you all know, he's one of the same characters that I use for a, uh, road to the show. And, uh, you know, I, I said I wasn't going to really make a series out of it on, uh, YouTube, just play it kind of on my own and experience the game mode. And I'm happy I didn't because, um, Avon... You know, I went through all the stuff with high school, got to uh, pick out of my choice of schools, and I ended up deciding with Georgia Tech, I'm sorry, Virginia Tech um, for him. And I came in as the second string quarterback, and I am now going through um, what everybody has basically told me about or stated on YouTube is this huge issue with coaches' trust. Um, you know, you, you play practice, you make a few good throws, and then, you know, you get one one time you get sacked, and you pretty much just lose all your points. And, you know, like I said, I'm sure people have already mentioned this or you've already heard about it, but, you know, I'm going through the same thing now. And I'm playing on Heisman mode just because I wanted to challenge myself. So I'm kind of uh, upset with that. Now, a patch did come out recently for this game. I don't know if they fixed anything for Road to the Glory with that patch. Uh, so we'll see. I'll have to turn turn it back on or load it back up. But I played, you know, I did two practices. 
there was this one point where I got like 90 coach trust points. You know, I had a bunch of completions in a row, good plays in a row. And I got sacked once on like an all-out blitz, and I just couldn't get rid of the ball in time, and everything went away. Um, and I was just really frustrated and haven't even wanted to, you know, load that game mode back up. So uh, I'll give it a try now that this uh, patch came out and see if maybe they fixed anything. I'm not really sure if they did. I don't think they did, but we'll see. Um, and then the Charlie Ward uh, Heisman challenge that I posted, a, you know, two episodes of. Um, just because of everything that I'm going to be busy with. Look at Dan Evans getting his Cody Green on, but then he fumbles. I tried to slide. I really did. Sometimes slide just doesn't work when you want it to. They don't do it. And uh, that time I had to pay the cost. But yeah, uh, with the Charlie Ward, I'm not going to, you know, I haven't uploaded an episode of that in a while. I'm not going to really, con well, I am going to continue it, but I'm not going to do it every week. It might get a little boring, so... Basically, I've been playing it without recording it the last couple days. And when I get to, like, an important game, I'll probably record it. And then, you know, when we get towards the end of the season to see if I win the Heisman, which I expect I would, um, I'll record that as well. So I'm not completely abandoning that Charlie Ward Heisman challenge, but I am going to kind of tone it down. Look at that. Another nice throw. Dan Evans kind of scrambles, gets forced out of the pocket, and still finds a guy deep down the field. I really uh, enjoy Dan Evans' uh, just uh, quarterback ability so far. And uh, he's just playing really well at this point. So, again, we could have a quarterback controversy at our hands. Uh, you know, he'll definitely be starting next game as well. So, we'll see how things go. Um, I'm very far along in this franchise, or I'm sorry, I keep wanting to call it a franchise. I'm very far along in this dynasty. Um, I've just really been wanting to play it a lot. Every, you know, everything's recorded, so you guys will be up to date, but um, I'm trying to record the commentary to these as fast as possible, even if I'm not going to release them. You know, for example, I'm recording this, this commentary right now. You guys might not see this episode for a week or so. Um, and I'm just trying to get everything in order for when I start my new job uh, in a couple weeks here. So I have content to upload to you guys and uh, not leave you hanging. But, yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with this. Um, I did start, I, I mentioned in the last video that I started a Nebraska Dynasty just kind of on my own. I ended up deleting it. Um... It just, I don't know, something wasn't going well with it, and I just kind of wanted to start over. Plus, I, I don't know, I found the, the recruiting for it was getting, I don't know how to explain it. Basically, I started another uh, off, or on, yeah, offline dynasty for my own time, and actually this time picked the Louisville Cardinals. So it's a team that's in a, uh, you know, a smaller conference, not as good. Um, and they play the style that I like. They have a lot of younger players, sophomores and juniors and freshmen. So um, I'm going to give that a try. Hopefully one day I will end up recording gameplay for it for you guys. What was that play right there that the computer ran? It's like a fake flea flicker, uh, a reverse flea flicker. I don't know. And also, I've mentioned it, the online dynasty that I'm doing with the uh, YouTubers in the Big Ten with Northwestern. I just played my week number four game this morning after or before I'm recording this commentary uh, and I got to play one of those FCS teams and I won 77 to nothing. Totally ran up the score. My halfback had 333 yards on only nine, I think nine carries, four touchdowns. Uh, my quarterback, who I'm really going to try to make a strong Heisman push for, he had four rushing touchdowns, over 100 rushing yards, three touchdown passes, I think around 200 uh, passing yards. Really good game for him. Really good throw right there. So we're going to go up 28 to, I believe, 13. And uh, Dan Evans still looking good. But, yeah, that that Northwestern franchise, or uh, keep calling it franchise. I'm so used to MLB show. Uh, the Northwestern online game with the YouTube guys. That was week four. Week five is conference play, and I'm going against Indiana, who is controlled by another person. Um, so I may record that once we play. You see Notre Dame trying to pull the upset there. 
third quarter, 21-17. I believe that Notre Dame did end up winning that game because they're not going to do another studio update. Um, but yeah, eventually when I get to this YouTube, uh, the YouTube dynasty and play some guys online, I might record it for you and kind of show you guys my recruiting and all that stuff going on with that dynasty. As well as uh, recruiting for this one. I mentioned it last episode. I will be showing you some recruiting, but not until after week six. I have recorded it already, so you'll be able to see the guys that I'm going after and all that stuff. As well as uh, top 25 polls, league leaders, things like that. Uh, but you see we're going to move to 4-0, 28-13 win. Uh, everything's looking good, even though Cody Green's out. Haven't lost a beat yet. And uh, look forward to the next game. I honestly don't remember who it is. I know it's a conference game. Um, so week five coming up here soon. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave it a rating. Also, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Link is in the description. For now, guys, I'm out. Popular Stranger. Peace.